What's going on, guys? Welcome to today's episode of the Yacht Yacht Show. We are in the turkey woods trying to find us an old gobbler that wants to play the game. <sighs> We're just walking these old roads. Not doing a whole lot of calling. I'm just in the woods listening. I really would like for Harlow to kill a bird here. But hey, because I only get one bird on the club. And that's fine because when it comes to the wild turkey population, even though they're great on the club here, we don't want everybody just knocking them out just because they gobble or just because they're here. I want to keep that seed going and going and going. But anyway, I'm just out walking, chilling. Got a good little walk there to do. And uh, once we kind of get there and listen around, like I said, we got 16 food plots on this place. I'm just creeping. Got a power line up here. Hopefully we can hear some birds gobble or see some birds strutting. Just sit down and chill and take it easy. I don't know how well the footage would be, even if I get one. But we shall see. We're gonna go see old, we're gonna go with Red in the morning. Old Red has invited me to go on a turkey hunt with him. But I'm not sure if Red's gonna let me shoot or just gonna let me call. I don't know. I ain't the greatest at either of them, but we're gonna try. Anywho, stick with us and let's see this old springtime weather. come alive in the woods as everything's starting to bloom and whatnot. Thank y'all. Hit the like and subscribe. And go to yachtyacht.com. Get your yacht yacht hat if you want one. Come on. Let's ease on down here and see what we got. <laughs> it's a little wet down here. Got a big storm last night. Cutting up, ain't they? <laughs> guess they didn't like my owl hooting. I guess the older I get. Just enjoy sitting down. <laughs> That's a good little walk. I probably I don't walk from the where we park our trucks all the way to the back part of the property. Uh, many many y'all probably remember when my wife shot a deer. It was kind of just right back here. So, anywho, I got a lot of walking left. Make it back to the truck, but. I'm just slipping. I'm doing a little calling. That's about as much calling I'm going to do. 
I just enjoy listening to the woods and see what the other turkeys are doing. There's one in there that's hot that gobbles on his own. We'll go to him. There's hens yapping. We'll yap back, but it's just a peaceful piece of property. I trap all those hogs. I trap hundreds of hogs a year. And uh, just to be able to hunt in this place. And, man, I just like taking it all in, you know? So, anyway, let's get to walking and uh, see what else we can come up with. More water, more water. You can see where the hogs, you can see where the hogs have been rooting up. I mean, not rooting up, but rubbing up against those trees. They just rubbed a high slap off it right there. The bark. Look right here. That's a good muddy spot. That's active. Look how muddy that water is. Compared to that clean water, muddy water. We got hogs down in here. I better not see one. I bust him, dude. It is wet. It is wet, wet. I ain't heard no bird gobble yet. All I'm so, I think that's the road. But it's so full of water, we had that big rain last night. But dude, I could just see if it wasn't so nasty. I could just see some old birds coming up through here, dude. Y'all feel like y'all with me? Now this road comes out back out to the power line. Once I get up here, you never know what's in that power power line. It's a food plot right there, so let's keep an eye on it when we go out there. there there's that power line I was talking about. All right. We want to ease up there. Check it. I don't know if I can get there to get a shot, but I'd love to bust one.
50 yards. Did it right there. Right. Well, there you go. <laughs> oh, smoker. All right, she's got a little blood, so I'm gonna drag her back out of the way a little bit. Hey, the old red dot put it right on her head. Oh, let's see how far that was. It can be. I was one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, and then I was. Oh, I was right there. I was right there. So eight, nine, about eleven or twelve steps. Just smoked. I could have shot those piglets, got my numbers up, but we'll trap them. We'll trap them. I just wanted to bust a good old sow. Come on. Ooh. So initially, you can't see it, but we're like five or six. Uh, one, two, three, four light poles down from way down there, guys. I could see these. I saw these pigs earlier, and that's why I made that loop all the way through these through the, around. And uh, I figured they might still be here, but I wasn't sure. But uh, we come out right there. That's where we come out. So we actually come out to the right of that shooting house and then come across. And as I come across, I crawled right up through here and got within, like I said, 12 steps of her. She faced me. She kind of, I don't know if she winded me because the wind was in my face. But anyway, uh, she knew something wasn't right. Anyway, she got, I don't know why this thing focuses like that. She got teats. And uh, so some of those were here, hers. But uh, anyway, like I said, I could have shot a wad of them, but 
just save us old turkey leg. We'll trap them pigs. It ain't no big deal, but got that mama down because so from the time she would have been bred by the end of turkey season already and been ready for the summer. So we just we just stopped some of that too. So anyway, oh, let's get her up and get a pick, and then uh, we got a long walk out of here. Maybe we'll hear one gobble on the way out, but this turkey hunt turned into a pig stop. Booyah! Number, we had 54 plus 19, 73. That's number 74 on the club. If I make it to 100, I get two bucks. Come on. Ooh. Well, guys, <sighs> got the first one knocked down. I think that's the first pig I've ever shot with my turkey gun, actually. And uh, with the red dot for sure. <laughs> Let's talk about it. It's open. Oh. Uh, <sighs> well, like I said, I come here to turkey hunt to kind of hear some turkeys. And like I said, we always got pigs on this piece of property. And think about it. I make my live, live in trapping and hunting pigs. And I'm in a hunting club that God has blessed me with that's loaded with pigs. It's always got content to help uh, so y'all can kind of hang out with me a little bit. But man, like I said, and not to talk too much about the, 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 the red dot. You know, I don't want to try to just sell you. But you do get... Uh, a little percentage if you go to metacreekmounts.com and use promo code yop yop <laughs> anyway that's the first time i've ever used a red dot uh on a shotgun or rifle or, or, or any kind of firearm and like i said i was 12 yards the, the, i shoot the turkey low tss so it hits a lot harder normally i probably wouldn't have made that with a lead shot but hey dead hog is dead hog and he dropped in his tracks uh, right here and we know we got like 10 piglets and uh, there was a two, what, two or three more in there. I had to go back, but anyway, knocked him down with the old super black beagle. <laughs> yo, yo, addition. Any which way? Well, we're going to get this one out of the way. Got a long walk, uh, back to the truck. And, uh, man, just enjoying God's creation. Thank you, Lord Jesus, for another day. And thank you guys. Hit that subscribe button. Hit that like button. The algorithm tells people to come on in and join the party. <laughs> Oh, man. Anyway, sun's going down. Let's get to walking, son. Let's roll. I don't have my can am here to come get her. It's too wet to get back down in here. But, hey. Nuisance animals of Mississippi. We got to kill them. Whew. My main objective on this channel, guys, is always be 100% uh, percent with you. You know, sometimes, ooh, I fell in a hole. Uh, sometimes we feed families and sometimes we feed the buzzards. But when it comes to pigs, man, you just can't let them keep destructing the land. So anyway, that's what they're doing, rooting up that field right there. As you can see, look at all that green. And then you had those low spots where they just root up and tear it up. So anyway, it is what it is. But... Thank y'all so much. If y'all also, I forgot to tell y'all, if you're at yachtyacht.com, you can actually be a fan subscriber and you get to see a, uh, a bunch of the head knocking uh, from the traps that I don't get to show on the regular channel. But hey, if you're into that kind of thing, it's like $2.99, like $2.99. So, and then if you decide you don't want to do it, cancel it after you don't watch everything. I don't care. <laughs> Just trying to, whew, trying to make a little trailer hood around. But anyway, let me pick up my vest, put it back on, and uh, we're walking out of here, so we got the long way home. Whew, man. So, I, of course, I haven't went back and watched the video yet because I'm still in the woods, right? I don't know what I'm editing, but... Was it loud? Was was my crunching loud? This microphone picks up on this phone. So it probably sounds a lot better. But I was trying to get up on it, but it was so crunchy. And then I got in the... What happened was I got in the, the water. And when I got in the water, I got to a point where I was hung up by the, uh, the branches. So finally I got out on my knees and got up there. But dude, smoked. And I almost... If, the, if those pigs would have come the other way, which I only had three shells, so if the other big pigs would have come to my left, probably could have smoked too, but one in the hand, better than two in the bush. My wife's gonna be so proud of me. She loves, she loves an old pig trapper. 
knock some heads. <laughs> uh, Y'all, to everybody in the comments, they say, she's so blessed. <laughs> I want to read all that. She's so blessed. Uh, thank you, Lord, for another day. Oh, man, I remember now. The other day, I tried to come down here in my truck. And uh, the road was blocked by this log. And it's not a heavy log, but it wouldn't break with me. Of course, I didn't try to... I didn't try to strap a log to it or anything. I mean, strap something to it to pull it. But anyway, uh, I need to get that up. Because you definitely can't get back there until you do something with that. Which you can try to go around, but not in my truck. Not in my truck at all. <laughs> uh, still ain't heard no turkey bird, y'all. If it's deer season, she'd be gone. <laughs> oh, I love it. Thank you, Lord Jesus. Thank you, Lord Jesus. Well, guys, guess I'm going to sign out and put down, let's see, out and we'll put hog. <laughs> Well, only turkey goblin today, I guess, will be me. But any which way, I appreciate y'all being here. And uh, for this run, turkey hunt turned into a whole killing. Come on. Any which way, y'all have a good one. God bless. And as always, Jesus loves you. Ow!